Harold. Hello. Where's everybody? This is everybody. This is, we are everybody. <laughs> God. Okay. So start, giving, start giving the daff already, Harold. <laughs> yeah. I still don't understand it, no matter how many times I go over it. Over and over and over. It's like, I don't know. I don't. I can't, <laughs> I can't hop it because it's, it's so. I, it, I got to give you credit for it, going over it. I don't even go over it. No, I do it with Stefanski. I do it with Ernie. And then yeah. uh, some, once in a while, uh, Steve Weiss's son does it. And it's still, it's like just a, this is this, but then this one dies. And it's, it's never going to happen. I don't know. I'm usually, uh, oh. yeah. Hey, guys. Hello. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Five, five o'clock at Shul. Tomorrow, well, Ernie, 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 can can we make it, uh, Rabbi Einhorn Shear is at, uh, at six o'clock. So in order to walk to Shul, I know that Rabbi Segelman is also four, at 45 10, minutes. To say, 10 to yeah. we'll stop at four. We'll stop at 15 minutes to six. How much? Quarter to six. Quarter to six, we'll stop. 5.45. 5.45. Okay. It'll give you time to get a second wife. <laughs> Thank you very much, Harold. You, you're Harold, very welcome. Yes, Harold, are you? Are, you know, are you? Are you know, you should be in the desert to this Shabbos. It's a hundred. <laughs> well, so we're not far away here. Yeah, you're not Ninety-five. Far away. I'll be hundred. Wow. No, it was a hundred and one before. Come on. My watch said ninety-five. Wow. Okay. It's hot. So the we're in Lamed Amad Aleph, near the bottom. So Ravashi Kashad Rav Nachman. Rav Nachman learned Ein Zika. And Ravashi learns Yesh Zika. So how does Rav Nachman explain? Amrucha Ravashi. That even without, remember, we're talking about two, three, three brothers. And Levi was married to a strange woman. Um, the Ruvain divorced his wife, and then Levi died. So, really, even without Mimer, Nachris Michlitz Klitzach, the Zika is enough even without Mimer. I mean, just the fact that the woman fell and was a lady in waiting for Ruvain to marry her and he had not divorced his first wife who was the sister of Shimon's wife. So that creates a wife through Zika. You would not be able to be Miyabim her because Zika is enough, Michlitz also. I, it said Mimer, Hadithani Mimer. Lafuke Beishamid, I mean Mimer Kornikin and Gomer. He just wanted to tell you that he didn't hold like Beishamai who held that when you do Mimer, you acquire it completely and it would have freed her as it saw her completely. Kamash wanted Lokabe Shama that she needs Chlitza. And it's not Kenyan Gomer. Now, vice versa, Rav Nachman Kashid Ravashi. How does Rav Nachman explain Ravashi? Rav Nachman says, Ein Zika. Ravashi says, Ye Zika. Chite muadin dafilu meis. For example, let's say Levi died first before Reuven divorced his wife. And so there, the woman fell. There was a Zika. Maybe you'll say, that maybe you'll say that, listen, like Kenny said yesterday, as long as you divorce your wife and you're not married to her, that sorrow would be permitted, even if the, even if the Girushan happens afterwards. So, Elizui Lamute Mai. The Mishnah is saying this case and not in other case, what is, what is the other case being excluded? Lamute for example, if he had married Levi's wife and then did the Gerishim, well, then, of course, she's a tsara. You wouldn't be, then it would be potter from Yibam Mechlitza. But Tavra, that it's a broken mission, Misha Shonazu, Shonazu, two different Tanoim. Bahai Tanas over Misa Mapelis. What is the controlling? Action. It's the death of the brother. What is the status? If the if he's no longer married to Shimon's sister at the time of his death, that's what we look for. 
No, since he was married originally to the wife of the sister of Shimon, he can never marry her. So maybe Zui Lamuti Karnas of Asav Girish. Fine. Then we would understand why the Mishnah has to tell us that case. And eat several Karava. But if that Tana holds like Rava Dharma Loyalam Khatana, it's really only one Tana. And the Mishnahs are in the structure of the Zu Vain Sarah Lomer Zu. This and not only this, Khtani, means it's 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 correct in both cases. Then Zui the Mute Mai. So Al Korchak Rav Yirmi is fairly. He doesn't know like Rav. He holds like Rav Yirmi. So now we ask Lord Rav Anichi Sarva Lak Ravashi Zui the Mute Mai is below Girish. Fine. That's the case of him dying without divorce. Eli E Sarva Lak Rav Nachman Zui the Mute Mai. So Al Korchak Rav Ashi is fairly. So it's clearly each opinion has to hold like its own opinion. They don't. You can't reconcile it. Mishnah. New concept. The first Mishnah of Masechti of Vamas talked about two brothers, Reuven and Shimon. Reuven is married to Shimon's daughter. So it's an erva to Shimon. And Reuven has other wives. When Reuven dies without children, everybody is potter from Yibu Mechlitza, the erva and the tsaris of the erva. However, Kulan Shahayu Bahen Kidushin or Gerishin Besafek. For example, let's say the co wife was only married Misafek. We're going to see what we're going to, that means maybe the co wife was married to him, the Suffolk Kidushin, or maybe he Suffolk divorced her. So normally, if he was fully married to the Tzora and he's married to an erva, the Tzora goes out free. But if there's a Shaila on the Kiddush or the Gerishin, you can't be miyabim them, but you must give them chlitza in order to allow that. They can't marry out Lashuk without chlitza. Now, what does it mean, Suffolk, Gerishin Suffolk Kiddushin. Okay, it's a Suffolk Kiddushin. Zorak La Kiddushin. Suffolk Karev Lo, Suffolk Karev Lo. Is that what Suffolk Kiddushin? You have a star, let's say, that you can be Makadish a woman with a star. And you throw the star at her. And let's say you're exactly eight Amis away. And it lands right between them. So, it's a Suffolk, whether it was close to him and he was not Makadishur, or Suffolk close to her and he was Makadishur. Zehu Suffolk Kiddushin. That's Suffolk Kiddushin. And we're going to see what would be the Nafkaminas by having a Suffolk Kiddushin. Suffolk Gerishin. He's married to a woman, but Kosov Biksavyado, he writes a get. <coughs> Um, in his own handwriting. And we'll learn in, in Baba Basra that such a get works even without Adim. Cause of Iksad Yad Vein Alav Adim. Or Yesha Lav Adim Vein Bozman. There are Adim on the star, but there's no date. So that's a Safi Gerish, and I'm going to learn in Gitten. We're going to say if she remarries and has a child, the Vlad is not a mamzer. So here as well, the, the Tsara is going to be choiletzes if he gave her a get because it's a get. Because if she marries, it's a good, it's a good marriage. So we, but we can't allow Yibum because people will say, well, a Tsara's erva, you can do Yibum too. Another example of Safiget is Yesh Bozman Vein Bolav Eid Echot. There's the date, but only one Eid. Zeu Safiget. In all these cases, this creates this get puzzle, but it really, if she gets married, the child is not a mamzer. Now, you notice we were given different criteria for what made Kiddushin Safiget 
versus what made a get suffix. Why didn't we say by a get the same criteria by Kiddushin? You threw a get at the woman and it landed exactly in between suffix car of law, suffix car of law. Right? Ilu begershin, suffix car of law, suffix car of law, look ton, my time, why not? Amar Rabba, there's a reason for that. Isha, this co wife of Ruvain, was expecting with Ruvain's death to be able to marry anyone without chlitza or yibum because she's a co-wife of an erva. That's her chazaka. She's becheskas heter l'shuk omedes. Now, suffake that maybe he gave her a get and therefore you need yib, and therefore you're saying that maybe she wasn't divorced so she's still at sorrow. That wa- that's why you need chlitza. I'll tell her enemy suffix. Don't give her a problem to make her usher. Unle- un- uh, because of a suffix problem. The other cases of Gitan that are mentioned in the Mishnah, there's a chash. But here, we we, we, we should not um, force a chlitza when her chazaka is to be able to marry to whoever she wants. If she was married, he, she was perhaps married to this woman, and therefore she's at Soren and she would allow her, uh, would allow her if Ruvain dies to get married to anybody. It's only you're saying maybe it's not a Kiddushin, Misafik. You should say the same Svor by Kiddushin. The Gemara says, Hasam Lechum. <clears throat> By Kiddushin, we go to Chumrah. Perhaps we're talking here about Kiddushin to the Erva, but let's say she was married fully to, the, to another wife, and then maybe he got married to Ruven's daughter. Because of that suffix, we say that should, there shouldn't be Yibam only Chlitza. But then I That might be a chumrah that leads to a problem, to a leniency. Because Zimnin the Ozulhu Makadish Maybe he'll go ahead and give Kiddushin to her sister because he'll think that it's not a Kiddushin. Or Vinami Zinadasar Akhar Makadishala did not Kiddushin Vadai. Somebody else will give Kiddushin to this woman. The Kivan the Asr La Malat Sarla Yubmi. But if we're going to say that sorry, you can't ask her be, you can't do yibum to her. She's a co-wife. People will say that the original kiddushin of the of Reuven who died was a good kiddushin, and the second kiddushin given by a man is not a kiddushin. You can't give a kiddushin to an eshesish. I mean, to come a kiddushin and basher love kiddushin. So again, it's a chumah that comes to a kula. However, the Gemara says no. Now we're on Lamed Aleph, Ahmed Aleph. We started off Lamed, now we're doing Lamed Aleph. Kivin the Kamatzrech's Chlitza, since you're requiring Chlitza, made the Yadid the Chumrah Ba'almahu. People know it's only a Chumrah. And they won't um, question the original Kiddushin. Yachi Gerushin Ami Lisni. But then why not mention a get that was thrown halfway to her? The Litzrech Chlitza. And don't allow her to go free, but require chlitzu. Maybe yada the chumrah almu. People will know that it's a chumrah. However, we don't say chlitzu because imatayim erchod let says misyab bemis. Somebody will go in and be miyabim her, which we don't want to happen. Well, says the gemara chanami by kiddushin imatayim erchod let says people will do misyab bemis. Now, what's the problem? It is yabim bemikach klu. What harm is there in that case for chlitza to take place? Why? Because achazka kaima, because she remains becheskas heter. If it's cheskas heter, there would be no problem with yibum either. Abaya brings another very interesting question. Nafal abayas alav ve'al basachi. Reuven and Shimon. Reuven is married to Shimon's daughter. 
Reuven has other wives too. And a house collapsed on Reuven and his wife. And then there are these co-wives. And now what? Anya Dua is a man We don't know who died first. If the husband died first, he died marrying, married to Ruven's daughter and er to Shimon's daughter in Erva. Therefore, the co-wives would go out free, no yibam, no chlitza. Now the din is sarasa chilezas velomis yabera. It's a suffix because maybe the daughter died first, so he wasn't married to to the tsaras Erva when he died, and therefore the co-wives could have yibu. However, we say tsarasa chilezas velomis yabera because of this suffix. Fred Gemara Ma'ay Achanami Neima Isha Zubecheska Seter Lashuko Medes. Before the house collapsed, if Reuven would have died without children, and since Reuven is married to an erva, this co-wife would have gone out free, without even without cleats to be able to marry whoever anybody he wants without anything. Now misafek, because we don't know who died, died first, the husband or the wife, atabalo isra, al tasrena misafek, don't create an isra to safek like we said before. But that can't work either because it's a chumra to asi de kulahu. It's a stringency that will lead to a leniency. Sheimata oimer choilet says people will come to be misya bemis. Okay, Susie, everyone's going to have to go out of the room, please. So the Gemara answers. Gerish and the by a get. So Gazu Rabbonon, not to allow chlitza because people in the yapin. Why? Because get is something that happens a lot. Mapoiles, a case where a house falls on somebody. Rabbonon didn't make this gzera, don't be choilitzer because maybe people were miyabing her. Or inami gerish in the kaima erba the kamuchach. By Gerishin, everybody knows that Shim, Reuven is married to Shimon's daughter. But Tzorosu Kamachatzras leads it yet. You're requiring, normally the Tzor goes out free if you're married to an erva. I'm teaching Daflani right now. Even though they're married to an every you're acquiring chlitza Amri, people will say, must be the get that divorced this co wife was a good get. And you could do Yibum, or, or let's say he was divorcing the, 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 the erva, so therefore he wasn't married to an erva. And maybe they would think that you could be miyabi mitzorah, but poiless. There, people will, will know that the Chachamim evaluated the get, and they can decide whether the get's a good get or not. But Chachamim are not Nevi'im. How can the Rabbonin give us an answer as to which one of these parties died first? They can't. Now, the Gemara started off by learning that. Our Mishnah only learned the case of giving, of throwing Kiddushin. Okay, I don't know. I, would you please ask everybody to go into a different room just for another 15 minutes, please? Thank you. We said before in the previous Mishnah that the Kiddushin was thrown partly towards her, partly towards him. We don't know. But we said the get doesn't have the same din. We came up with another criteria for how, why we have a suffix get. The Gemara says, the Gabi Kirushi Milotnan, I'll show you this. Taught. The Hatnan, I saw him at his Prashusarabi. 
The woman was in Rishus Rabbi Muzar Kola, and her husband threw her a get. Car of law, if it's close to her, Megureshes. Car of law, Eina Megureshes. If it's close to him, it's not a get. Mechzal, Mechzal, Megureshes, Ve'ena Megureshes. What does that mean, Megureshes, Ve'ena Megureshes? V'yamrin on Lamai Hilchasa. The e kohen who, if the man giving the get is a kohen, asurla he cannot marry her back again because she's a suffi grusha. The e erva he, if Reuven was married to Shimon's daughter and he threw the get at that erva, you would not uh, tsarasa would not be able to go out free as a co-wife of a tsara because it's a suffi. Maybe it's not a get. Boy chlitza. And there. Even though we're requiring klitsa, lo amin and shimato imer chuletes pesia bemis. How come over there we're not worried? Oh, people will see her getting klitsa; they'll also be miyabim her. So ha itmer Allah, Rabbi Rav Yosef Demer Tervayu. You know what? Over there is a different reason for why there was a suffix get. Hacha b'shtei kite edim askinon. Two groups of edim. Achas oimeres karav lo. Achas oimeres karav lo. One group of two Adim say was close to her. The other group of Adim say was close to him. That's two absolutely good Adis. And they're conflicting with each other. That creates a Suffolk Midoraisa. We have to go Suffolk Doraisa Lachumra. However, Masnis and the Kasachas, the Mishnah we quoted is one set of Adim. Where they argue, one of them says one thing, the other one says anything. So you can't be makariv, you can't be medayk. What the din is, and that's a sveika derabbanon. So umimai demas nisan dachah bekasachas. Where do you see that our mission is a case of one group of edim? Don't need the kiddushin. Now, how many groups of edim do you have by a chup of the kiddushin? One. Who says you can have multiple sets of aiding by a wedding? So the Gemara says, Well, if you have two aiding saying that she was divorced, so then the erva was gone, the tsar is free, she can have yibu. What are you talking about? We don't, we have some aiding that say the testimony just the opposite. Even when you have two groups of aiding, it, it creates a suffix to Rabbonon. The two aiders conflict. The wife remains with her original chazak, which is that she's married to a tsaras erva. Which is midi to have a nichse de barshatya, which is similar to a case in Baba Basra of the financial assets of a person who's not really in his right mind. The barshatya is of a nichse. A person that's not in his right mind sold assets. Also, Betray Vami Kishu Cholim Zavin. Two Adim said, you know, when he sold them, he was healthy. Vasu Betray Vami Kishu Stroyta Zavin. Two other names say no, he sold them when he was Meshiga. The owner of Ashi Oka Tre Ladi Tre, the two Adim conflict with each other. Now we're on Laman Alves on the days. The Ira, the land, Ukma Becheskas Parshat, it stays where it was because there's no real proof. So Amr Abaya, Yagida Lavra'u. One thing is learned from the other. Tana Bikidushin, Vu Adin Legerishin. The case was learned by Kiddushin, the same thing as by Gerushin. And Tana Begirushin, who had in the Kiddushin, both ways. Amalei Ravi, Agida Lav Ruv, we're going to learn that way. My Zehu Victoria, what did the Mishnah mean? This is the case. Zehu Safi Kiddushin, Zehu Safi Gerushin, which means it implies there's no other case. Now, Amalei Ravi, Kol Sheyesh Be Kiddushin, Yesh Be Gerushin. Whatever qualities are in Kiddushin are in Gerushin. The Yesh be Gerushin, Mashain be Kiddushin. But there are things in Gitin which don't exist by Kiddushin. 
Vizel de Gerish and Lab Dafka. When it says Vizel, it's not it's not Dafka, this only. It was said Zehu, it was a stylistic edit by the Tana. Mishum the Tana Zehu Bikidush and Tana Nami Zehu Bikidush. But don't medayek the way Zehu only this. Fine. Zehu the Kidush and Mute Mai. When it says this is the form of Suffolk Kidush, it came to exclude what? The Mute Zman. To exclude the case of, of time, which Lachura does not have to be by Kidush. Deleka bikidushin. Umit ne malo tiknuzman bikidushin. Why isn't, if you write a er, Ernie, there, there's no date in the kidushin? There's no date? Remember, Harold, we are makadesh a woman, bikesef, bishtar. Yeah, the vast majority of kidushin is done bikesef without a star. Oh. If, if you're makadesh with a star, you don't need a date. Uh huh. So the more explains to us why not. So, a husband is allowed to eat the fruits of a field that he acquires when he marries his wife. His wife brings in fields that she got from her father. Once a husband gives his wife a divorce, he can't eat from those payers. So having a zman on the get is important regarding payers. Now, you don't need zman on kiddushin because Arusa less lay payri. When a man gives kiddushin to a wife, he doesn't acquire the right to eat the payers of that field with kiddushin or with nesui. Now, now, Susie, please help me. Basa Choysoy means like this. Reuven is married to Shimon's daughter. It's his niece. He's known his niece all his life. So he, he, he loves his wife in a way more than other people loves their, love their wives because he was actually related to her. Now, the reason they require a get on a Zman on a get is because if there was no Zman on a get, this husband might forge a different date to try to protect his wife slash niece from a claim of adultery that might put her to death. Because they'll say, oh, you know what? I divorced her a month before it's claimed that she had relations with somebody else. So if that's the reason why we put a zman on a get. So there's also a good reason Liskin zman on a kiddushin. Because if you didn't have zman on a kiddushin, a, a, a husband married to a niece could do the same shenanigans. So the Gemara answers, we don't have to worry about that. Since the majority of people are Makadesh with money, they were not Mesakin Zman in the Kiddushan. When you buy and sell a slave, the they're also, some people acquire with money. Some people acquire the slave with a star. Yet the Chachamim established his man. So the Gemara says, The majority of people acquire an Eved with a star. The majority of men only makadesh with money. Now, if you want, I'll give you another answer. That there's really a loy efsher going on here. That to put his mind would lead to problems. Who's going to watch this star? Leave it by him. He'll erase the date if he wants to protect his wife. Excuse me. Leave it by her. She'll erase it. Leave it by him. Again, maybe he'll be married to his niece. He wants to save her life and he'll forge it. If we leave it by the Adim, eat his if they remember without 
the document Lacey Lesud. Let them come and testify based on their memory because that's preferable. The Elah. And if they don't remember, maybe the Adam will read the star, and it's only through reading. Adam have to testify orally, not from a written document. So the Kabar says, So why don't we give the same Terutzim by Adam on a get? The date helps a woman because she was an Asia Sish until that date. And now she's going to be afraid that she's going to watch that get very carefully because she needs that get to marry somebody else. But by Kiddushin, it makes her an Asia Sish. That puts her in trouble. She doesn't want to be an Asia Sish if she wants to fool around. So there, we're, we're worried that it's going to, she might without a date, add it in or, or not add it in because she wants to avoid punishment. Okay. I'm going to stop here because that way tomorrow we can start a new sugya clean yeah. when we learn in shul. Okay? So, go ahead. Go ahead, everybody. Everybody, everybody a good is, job. Is, is Yaakov here? Yaakov, Yaakov okay. Yeah, they came oh, yesterday. Very good. Very nice. Oh, very nice. Okay. Very good. Have a good job. Shabbos. everybody. Shabbos. Shabbos. Please leave your message for four two. Yeah, I love that.